This graph shows the number of new cases of Ebola in Liberia from 15th of August all the way up to the first week of December. And look, in mid-August it was about 10 cases per day, then started the catastrophe. It increased like this and continued up to almost 70 registered cases in the end of September. But there were also many missed cases, so it may have reached all the way up to 100 new cases per day. But then we are very sure that it came down like this during October, because the measures taken in this country were the right one in the catastrophe. Cases were isolated, population were informed, they changed their behavior, and uh, the dead bodies were taken care of for safe burials. Everything went relatively well, and we are now down here at 10 per day. But remember, the epidemic in Nigeria never reached one case per day. Nigeria didn't come up here. So we have more than 10, 20 times more difficulties here today in Liberia than Nigeria ever had. It means we have to now make functioning an almost perfect contact tracing system so that we can isolate all new cases very, very rapidly before they transmit to others. And that's what we are building now, but it will take a lot of resources and especially a lot of endurance because we may go several months into the next year, because the objective is very clear. We have to bring Ebola transmission to zero. The only safe and stable level of Ebola is zero cases.